فعاش القلب إخلاصا وصرت تحومك الطير تحلق في ثقافات وتنهل من روبا الخير You and I know that sometimes you hear a story and before you actually verify it you've already believed it and you've already issued judgment and you've already passed it on and the whole world already knows the wrong story don't we do that it's a fact we all do it i'm guilty perhaps as well because subhanallah we all require attention myself included it does not mean that because i'm talking to you i'm a saint no i'm talking to you i need what i'm saying more desperately than you may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala rectify me and forgive me and may Allah forgive all of us. So my brothers and sisters, what is important for us to remind each other about is whenever a tale comes to you, don't believe it. Authenticate it, verify it. Number one, if it does not concern you, throw it out. You've got enough in your memory. You know, today we lack concentration in salah. We lack concentration in so many good deeds. We feel lazy to do good deeds. Can I tell you why? Let's go back to your mobile phone. What phones do you have? Samsung? iPhone, Huawei, if you want to call it that, or Huawei. When I went to China, they told me it's pronounced Huawei. I said, okay, no problem, it's a Huawei. Whatever you have, my brothers and sisters, by the way, that's a very, very good phone. SubhanAllah, I've been using it for, for a while. 128 gigabytes is just the standard memory. I don't know why I'm advertising for them. But anyway, the point I want to raise is when you have a memory, what happens? You've taken a few photos, you've, ha you've got a few videos, you've done a few things, and the next best thing is the phone is full. It becomes slow, it becomes sluggish. Why? You just got it, but the memory is full. Too many photos, too many videos. Wallahi, my brothers and sisters, do you learn a lesson from that? about your own system. We also have a brain. We have a gigabyte capacity, terabyte capacity. You have a mind. If you fill it with unnecessary pictures, a lot of memory is taken by photographs. A lot of your memory is consumed by images, by videos, by pornography, by that which is haram. Too much is occupied. So now when you try to activate and you quickly want to say Allahu Akbar, your mind is sluggish. By the time your system kicks in, the Imam is already saying Assalamu Alaikum wa Rahmatullah. Why? Your phone, subhanallah. Your memory. So we become sluggish. Take it out. That's why I say we need to clean ourselves. Save yourself by deleting that which is unnecessary from your system. How many of us have restarted our phones and restored factory settings or got a chip external hard drive to say this, I don't need it right now. Shift all the photos into there so that my phone can work. Subhanallah. Let's do it to ourselves. Take out, format, go back to factory settings. It's Ramadan. You can return to factory settings by saying, Allahumma inna ka afuun. To hibbul afwa fa afu anni. You will reset your system by the will of Allah. Wallahi, I promise you, you get up fresh from Ramadan. Click, click. You're there for Salatul Fajr, the first day of Eid. MashaAllah, Masjid is full. Why? I have a new system. As soon as the bell rang, I was up before that because I'm used to getting up so early. Allah helped you. But with us, no. We'd start downloading unnecessary things. I have a grudge against that one, hatred against this one. I'm into pornography. I'm into adultery. I can't wait to commit that sin, this sin, into gambling, into drugs, into my gangs, etc. Be careful. Let's improve ourselves. My brothers and sisters, we can do 